Good morning, everyone. This is Melanie from Lake Beams Treasures. Today is Wednesday, February 3rd. Oof. What a day. Um, I'm actually late. It's a little after 10 a.m. this morning, and oh, bad night last night. Well, first off, let me backtrack. Um, my husband and I, we finally talked. We made up. Things are much, things are much better between us. Um, I still, I'm not used to fighting. I was telling somebody that in all the time we've known, I mean, we've been living together for like nine years now. We've known each other for over 20 years. And in the nine years, this is only our second argument. <laughs> so I think that was just uh, letting off steam. But anyway, so we talked, we made up things. I feel better. Last night I had my sale and we were rushing around because I ended up picking up, um, picked up a thing of Barbies, a thing of Build-A-Bears. Oh, I just got a cha-ching. Thing of Barbies, a thing of Build-A-Bears, a big, beautiful curio cabinet, as well as uh, cute little refrigerators. <laughs> and I was running out of time. So I said, you know something? I'm not going to have time to pick all this stuff up, go to my sale. How about we just stop and get food? Originally, we were going to go to, like, Chicken Express or something like that. But instead, we went to Wendy's because Wendy's is brand new, and I got the Baconator. Wow, was that a bad idea. Oh, my God. I got deadly sick last night. I woke up at, like, 3 a.m. in the morning, and I was, oh, my God, I was vomiting. Oh, do I? I'm sorry. I don't mean to make you guys sick. I was literally vomiting up until, like, 5 a.m. in the morning. And then by 5 a.m., I just passed it and went to sleep. So I feel much better now. So I know it's not, it was definitely the food because all I kept tasting was, well, all right. Anyway, <laughs> way too much information. Back to why you came here. So I meet up with the husband. I ended up getting that amazing collection of Barbie dolls. I ended up getting sick last night. Um, the auction was, was, um, not auction, the buy it now sale was really good last night. And that brings us to what sold. So on the eBay side, I only sold four items. Not too bad. The first thing I sold, of course I'm selling movies. This one's called a director. Sold this one for $5. And then Pumpkin Head, Ashes to Ashes. This has been a popular uh, movie I've been selling. I'm selling this almost every day. I believe I have five more copies. So as long as I keep finding them, I keep replenishing it. Um, I call things like these fillers because the annoying thing is I'm really, really not making money off of this. I mean, I'm selling it for $5. It's costing me $3 to ship. By the time all is said and done, I'm making less than a dollar off of it. So um, these are just quick fillers for the store. However, every dollar does count and every dollar adds up. Um, I did sell this book. But you know, I love books because most of my books are freebie books. This one's Pure Profits by Al Auger. It's pinpoint winning properties, things like an investor and succeed in commercial real estate pure profits. Uh, this one sold for $7. And then I sold a hat. Now, I'll be honest, I am starting to swear by hats because I buy my hats, like I said, 25 50 cents the most i'll pay for a hat is a dollar and to be able to take a hat this one i paid a quarter for to be able to take a hat and flip it for 18 dollars that's how much i sold this is a great thing now this one is a little beat up i'm gonna like straighten it out try to but i always ship my hats in a box i'll wrap it up in um like tissue paper or something like that these are super light they go first class only cost about four dollars for and change to ship a hat which is really nice so the way i look at it anything selling over ten dollars and that's that's what it does so ten dollars for a hat is great i have about three tubs of hats that i want to start putting up online i put about 20 hats up already so um yeah if i could just Buy them for a quarter, 50 cents, turn around and sell them. Some of the hats, uh, I mean, are in the $20, $30, $40 dollar range. So I'm really happy. Vintage hats are the way to go, particularly um, if you find these knitted truck style hats. So, oh, and this one happens to say, I should tell you what it says. It says, uh, O'Mule's Irish Whiskey. 
uh, established in 1932. So that is my items for eBay. I also sold, I'm just going to highlight this. I'm not going to show everything, but in last night's auction, I was able to get rid of two big items. So I'm really happy on that. The first one I did, which I don't have to put this up on eBay, is the singing Kermit the Frog. Yes, I sold him at a ridiculously cheap amount. So the person who bought this is getting an incredible deal. He worked, although I did explain he needs batteries. So he's going to need batteries. But of course, with these things, the batteries are on the inside. So I don't want to take it out of the box. Um, but I sold him for $30. And then I sold Easy Bake Oven for $15. Now, of course, um, that's not including shipping. I do shipping. Um, can I dare say shipping on top? I think I'm allowed to say that because I add, um, I charge shipping um, in addition to the price that. So that's $30 there. That's $15 there. And then what I sold in the other stuff. <sighs> I'm out of breath already. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so today is Wednesday. Um, I'm wondering, should I do that video of all the Barbies? I might grab it because I've got some really cute ones, uh, some really nice. I mean, they're on doll stands and everything. Um, it's just difficult because it's so big. So I'm wondering, do I bring, do I just record on my... But I like to show everything. I don't know. Maybe I won't show it. <laughs> Maybe I'll just leave it as a surprise so nobody knows what it is. But I do like documenting things. So eh, maybe I'll bring the Barbie dolls and do a, a uh, video on that. But anyway, uh, this is Melanie with Lightbeam's Treasures. I will feel much better. Um, just to give the... Um, just to give the fill-ins tomorrow... I'm going to be on the Real Housewife with Angie. Friday, I'm going to be on my channel. We're doing trivia again. And that will be with uh, Record Create, Laura Vimos, and Marion. On Saturday, I'm probably going to join uh, Real Real Housewife again. Oh, and of course, Friday night, Mass Singer. We're getting down to the last and final two. It's exciting. I can't see. I can't wait to see who wins. Anyway, um, have a great day, everyone. Melanie with Lightbeam's Treasures.